somebody who knows like the culture because I always feel like I'm doing it wrong. But I always wonder. You know what I'm, I'm saying? Like, like, I've done it a few, but. But I just feel like you just go for it. But yeah, it's right? always like, it, it's is it really one, that simple? Right, it's not one of the. <laughs> right, it's that simple. It really is. <laughs> All right, where are you going first? I think I'm going to go right here. Growing up in Detroit, you kind of grew up eating. At least I grew up eating everything, kind of the same stuff, you know what I mean, that you eat. But when I became vegetarian, it opened up a whole new different world for me, because it got me out of my mindset of being kind of like that regular person who ate regular stuff and did regular things. It, it, it became everything. like... You can, you can change how you do whatever it is yeah, you do. Yeah, you know, Man, like, I, it felt cool to me to be able to say I'd had Ethiopian food and that I was interested in learning about that culture. What else can I put in that pocket? You know, what other you know, new experiences can I add in most there? Definitely, you know? Most and definitely, most definitely. It's strange to think about how a dish can really do that for you. That's and an and we're, we're so thing. lucky, we have so much of that. Mm -hmm. It's the same thing, whenever I travel and I can't just get it, like, mm -hmm. you can't even trust it, you go to a place, mm -hmm. but I'll walk into a spot and it's like, no, you can't assume that they're gonna have the tabbouleh right or the hummus or the yeah. garlic paste yeah. in that. Yeah. Whereas, you know, we're lucky here. It's, Great, everywhere. Right? That was on point, brother. Yeah, that was yeah, on point. Yeah. Good choice, good choice. Well, uh, it's, a, it's a nice night still. I think we should walk some good people yeah. watching in Ann Arbor. Uh, yeah, man, because even though I just said I unfortunately got to get my slice in for the day, so <laughs> if we can maybe walk past the slice joint, I might be able to muster we up could some do space. That. We could do that. Let's we'll, do we'll, it. we'll go the long way. Let's ride. Right. Gentlemen, please. Yep. <laughs> Man, let's there we go. Let's do it. I think this is my go first sit outside, beer. Man, on All right. I used to just come here for shopping. Like, it, I had a reason to come here. I was either going Something to the bar or going to the store to get this to, yeah, that you can only get in Ann Arbor. Yeah. But now it's like, okay, no, let's go, let's go find this bar. You know, we're talking about finding a bar to go to, and we're like, whoa, what's that? No, let's find it, man, you know? So I'm into that, I'm into that. Still plenty to be found. For sure. And you look and you see all this building, and that's the sign of true growth is, when you, you know, they're still building here, even though there's not a lot of space. I see a lot of cranes over that way, and they're trying to build up. And that mm -hmm. means people are coming because of what they're doing for the people here. You yeah, know, well, they got Google down here now, more and more and more different uh, satellite tech businesses and startups. They have a bunch of uh, business cultivation programs here, too. So that's growth that's happening, as opposed to growth leaving here at one mm -hmm. time. Oh, where's this eight ball? Uh, yeah, we should go uh, check out the eight ball, stick our nose in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Downstairs at the Blind Pig. OK. We walk this way. One and a half that way. Jason, thank you. Can I uh, bring two shots of Jameson, please? Very easy. We'll keep them going. All right. Yeah. Cheers. Yeah, for a couple yeah. hours, man. I'm gonna go yeah. put this show out, dude. I'll meet some couple cats. Yo, I'll hit you up soon, dude. All right, I'll see, you, I'll see you in the city. All right, brother. All right.